Uh, we, the roof leaks? Yeah, yeah. My roof leaks. <laughs> I always have a hard time starting to sing this, so give me a few tries. A couple mulligans wouldn't hurt. Shot? Need <laughs> any percussion? Hey, hey, take your warm-up, Cam. Take a warm-up, Cam. Need some fish or like a... What did you say? Mullet? Like whatever. Mulligan. 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 Yeah. It's a golf term. This, a, this song is about a, uh, a laborer on one of my jobs. It was just a... What week is it? Odd guy. Uh, the Ruth Lee. Lee. Oh, that's right. Good job, reporter. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Thanks, Kayla. What was that? I worked with a man named Gino yeah. who had met with Nelson. He still rode a bike to work and he scrounged around for cigarette butts. Middle-aged man, not a thing to his name, never known to have many friends. But he'd find a button, steal a light from my torch, and then the stories would begin. Gino had a wife and farm somewhere in the Midwest. Then one night his wife, she died, and he drank away all the rest. Twenty odd years of rambling just to keep him from that place. Sitting near rock bottom, but you couldn't see it in his face. Because Gino was a good man, even when he wasn't good at all. Never had a damn thing to his name, but in his stories he once held them all. Another one, Gino, tell me a story till the end. Right. Wednesday before Thanksgiving, old Gino was wearing a grin. A brand new pair of secondhand jeans and a freshly shaven chin. Boy called him up from Kansas. He told him, Pop, come on home. It's a long Thanksgiving weekend. You don't need to spend it all alone. Gene came home on a Monday. He was floating on thin air. He said, I'm sorry to tell you, boys, but I'm moving back out there. My boy said, come, pack my things, he'll be calling me four years in. He's got a home there waiting for me, with 25 acres of land. Because Gino was a good man, even when he wasn't good at all. Never had a damn thing to his name, but in his stories he once held them all. Smokes long before stories. I'm glad to call that man my friend. The last time I saw Gino, he was living in a storage bin, leaking roof with extension cords to keep his heater plugged in. I hand him a half pack of smokes. I reached out and shook his hand. I said, I'll see you on the next job, friend. Maybe sooner, if I can. Gene died two weeks later when pneumonia stole his lungs. A poor man gets no funeral, so we pitched in to send him home. Oh, Gino died waiting for a call with a suitcase under his arm. So we packed it with his ashes, sent him back to the family farm. Because Gino, he was a good man, even when he wasn't good at all. Never had 
and dancing to his name, but in his stories he wants to tell them all. Well, I love one Gino, tell me a story till the end. Run out of smoke so long for stories, I'm glad to call that man my friend. Gino's short smoke stories. I'm glad to call that man my.